en anglais. I think one of the things that is really important to me is for people to understand that Quebecers come to, as a culture, to a place of defense of individual freedoms and rights and liberties from a place of having, before the Quiet Revolution, um, suffered the yoke and the attacks on individual rights and freedoms of an oppressive church. And that comes with it a certain perspective around what secularism is and the role of religion in society that informs what modern Quebec is. Quebecers are not racists. Quebecers are among the people who are the strongest defenders of individual rights and freedoms, along with a lot of other Canadians. But what we need now is people who can understand and bridge those two realities, the realities of, of a community uh, that, for whom, the Muslim community for whom, and others for whom religion is extremely important to them in a private and a public way, and Quebec society that is uneasy with um, religion because of its, uneasy with religion is a simplified version of it, but it's, it's, a, it's a, a certain unease with a certain type of authority. That it comes from a very genuine and real place. And it's super easy for people to simplify and try to attack either side. Well, what we need is a conversation about the fact that we all agree that rights and freedoms need to be protected and how in a pluralistic society, a place of diversity and strength, we're able to not just coexist but understand each other, respect each other's priorities and desires and build a better future. These are the things that societies like Canada will always have to grapple with and the way to grapple it is to bring forward people who are open to those conversations and open to that engagement and that's uh, what I know that Amira is.